What up y'all, how's it going? Ben Dane here. Today, I'm in my kitchen because I'm gonna be cooking up and eating something I've never had before, beans on toast. It's an English classic. If you've never heard about this before, I don't really blame you. It sounds pretty strange, but I hear they eat it a lot over there, um, especially for breakfast maybe, or really whenever you want. All you really need is some bread, uh, some beans. I got some Heinz baked beans, uh, maybe some butter, microwave, and a toaster. That's pretty much it. So let's get started here. Um, I only have a two slice toaster, so I'm gonna have to cook up two at a time. You gotta get these beans. You know, you can't use bushes. You just can't, that's what I hear. You gotta use the Heinz burn. And supposedly it's, it's in tomato sauce, which could be a little bit different. I don't know, I've never had these kind of baked beans before. So open the can here. Mm. I mean, it smells kind of like the baked beans that I'm familiar with, but I'm thinking it might have maybe more of a ketchup-y flavor or a tomato-y flavor, I should say. I don't have a legit container for the microwave, so I'm just gonna cover it in a paper towel and get these cooking up. So I heard about beans on toast a couple years ago now on a YouTube video, and I'm like, I'm thinking, What's, what's the big deal about it? Because it's a staple food. I, would, I don't know what to compare it to exactly, but maybe even something like a PB&J or something. You know, this is really simple and quick and cheap and easy, but is it too simple? You'd think it would taste like beans on toast, but does it? So the beans need about another minute or so, and hopefully, I mean, I think this is good looking toast. And this is some, some nice bread I, I picked up at the, at the local bakery, you can see. Uh, it's pretty thick cut. Got that nice toasty texture. I'm a butter guy, you know. Oh, that is hot. I think the beans are about done though. Yeah, they got a good little steam coming off them. These baked beans do have a little bit of, I wanna say Heinz tomato soup flavor. Tomato soup goes well with another kind of bready, toasted, classic grilled cheese. So maybe there is something to the whole, you know, buttered, kind of toasted or grilled pieces of bread with the tomato, I don't know. I'm really getting excited here. Here we go. Let's get it all on there. It's a hot bowl. Um, <laughs> looking like some beans on toast. Take a look. So let's try this out. I don't know if I should use a fork or my hands. Uh, usually I'm a, I'm a hand type of guy, so <laughs> this could be the wrong way to eat it, but let's go in for a nice hearty bite. That's delicious. Oh my, oh my word. They're on to something over there. They're on to something. This is more than I expected for sure. I was very skeptical about, you know, how could you make, like what's so special about beans and toast? But there is something special, I'm telling you. The, the way the, the, the textures, um, the, the sauce that gets absorbed into that toast. I'm gonna try a little fork, try to be a little bit more civilized. I mean, the butter, the way that um, melds into the toast flavor and into the, the sauce flavor. Like, you might think this is one of those foods that you come up with when you're high at 2 a.m. or drunk. And I'll tell you what, that would be pretty good as well. Mm. 
But if someone's serving this up to me in the morning, any morning, I would t gladly eat this. Actually, not even the morning. I would eat this any time of the day. I'm not sure if there's other variations on this. If you can, if some people will add um, other things to it. I didn't get that deep in my research, but for one, you don't really need to add anything else. I think cheese. But the moment I took a bite, uh, I kind of reminded me of a grilled cheese sandwich like I was talking about earlier. And I think sprinkling on some cheese on top, some shredded, some white cheese perhaps, that would be truly amazing. You know, English food gets a bad rap, but I'll tell you what, there this is some this is some good stuff. Granted, I was very hungry. Mm. I mean I think people have different ways of eating this. Without the butter, it might not be as savory, as delectable. And I would definitely recommend to put some butter on there. Again, some cheese. I don't know if you if there's any meats that would really add to this. Maybe some bacon bits. I feel like that would be pretty nice as well. I am actually just very surprised and uh, almost amazed. Cause I've seen other people eat this and like, yeah, you know what? It tastes like beans on toast, which it does, but it is more than that. I'll tell you, it is more than just that. This video goes out to all my peeps in the UK. I love the UK. And I'll tell you what, I'm definitely gonna be eating this again. Thoroughly enjoyed that. Go out and try this. Get you some cheese, maybe some mozz or something. Uh, and if you don't like this, then you're just, you might just be a little bit basic. Or maybe I'm the basic one for liking this. Who knows? Hope you guys enjoyed this. And thank you for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.